guys, it's me, it's Kian, and I'm playing Final Fantasy 14. Yes, I am. It's me. I'm doing it. Um, as you may very well know, the fair is a, s a story tradition that in recent years has served to promote the effort of the Adventurers Guild on behalf of the award. Yeah, I, I could say that a minute ago. Eorzean, uh, Eorzeans everywhere. Once again, we have got a piping hot plate full of exciting activities for one and all. This year, we've also been tasked by none other than Master Guruju. Our e ever generous patron of the event, I probably spelled that. I said that wrong. Uh, with creating the ultimate icy dessert to stave off the heat, we'd more than welcome the we'd more than welcome the aid of a skilled adventurer like yourself. And needless to say, we'd reward you well for your efforts. If you'll be willing and able to lend a hand, simply pop over to Costa del Packet and speak to my uh, colleague, Hemorrhage. Okay, so... Okey-dokey, uh, so I've got to go to Costa del Packet. Okay, right, okay, so... Um, let's see what... Okay, so, uh, Costal Packet. So, it's got a Costal Packet. These are the horns I want on the other one. Let me have a look and see. Um. Ba da 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 da. Oh, pardon me. So yeah, I'll get this one done, and then I will. Ah, uh, I'll uploading something uh, to my YouTube channel. Hopefully, that'll pacify. Okay, so let me just check what um, what my hat is. It is uh, the Arcid of what? Archidemon horns. Archidemon horns. I don't know what that is. I don't even know where that comes from. Okay, we're at Costadel Packet. So I love coming here and doing my fishing. Ooh, that's something else I can do. I can do the Hildebrand quest. I haven't started that on the other one. Right, okay, let's have a look. Costadel Packet. Oh, right, we've got to go over there. Okay. So. I'm going to go. this. Uh, my motorbike look, don't I look cool on my motorbike? I love my motorbike. Again, it's the only only man I bought from the store so far. It's cool. And yeah, fine motorbikes, it's not real. I don't I don't think it should be able to fly to be perfectly honest if you've got wings. It should have wings to come out when it flies, I think. That'd be good. I'll make it a bit more reasonable. And these are the mounts that we can get for this festival look, so Let's go to hemorrhoids. There we go. Is this hemorrhoids? Get off! Hemorrhoids. Welcome, friend, and I hope you enjoy the festive. Wait a minute. That's a uh, uh, that's adventurous garb. If ever I saw some, did Mararu send you to help with our confectionery challenge? And how glad I am to hear it. God's honest truth. We're a bit of a bind here. We're in a bit of a bind here. Uh, as uh, you uh, you see through, uh, though we've been tasked with making the most delightfully frosty dessert, 
we are suffering from a lack of all important ingredients. Ice. The shipment was supposed to come in bells ago, but word has it that it's been held up by some disturbance in the area. Might you be so kind as to check with my associate? Piano, piano. Oh, sugar plum berries. I, I think that's it. Uh, with my associate, uh, piano, and see if she knows anything further. She should be able to just. Uh, she should be just to the east of uh, of here, over on the beach. Okay, so uh, where am I? Where am I going? East or over there? We've got a piano. There she is. Okay, there's my little pig! Watch him, he's so funny. Go on, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it! Walk! He just walks. There you go, and then he falls over. Ooh, bonk! <laughs> Straight on his face, he makes me laugh. Okay, okay, piano. Okay, let's see what she says. basically heard you need some help. What's that you say? Hemorrhage sent you to ask about the delay. To be quite honest, the situation is something of a complicated one. As you may have heard, for this year's festivals... Uh, yeah, let's do it that way. Uh, Master Gregor... Gregor... Uh, yeah, yeah. Greg has imposed upon us a rather daunting task. Perhaps the finest frozen dessert in the realm has uh, has ever seen. Uh, he promised us that he would spare not a single gill to see the deed done. So we decided to enlist the service of one of the realm's most prominent confectioners. All well and good to this point, yes? Okay. Uh, as it turns out, the confectioner was, hopele uh, was a hopeless perfectionist, insisting that only the finest ice in all of Eorzea would serve for her creation. She hopped on the next vessel to the northern seas. Oh no, did she? Yes, she did. And that's the last we saw of her. It's uh, not that I fear for her life, mind you, pardon the pun, but she, she's one tough cookie. That said, the festivals are all upon, uh, but upon us, and if she doesn't make it back soon... Ye gods! That poor girl's droning out there! <gasps> oh no, somebody's droning. Oh, no, oh my goodness. Glub, glub, glub. And everybody just watching. Go and get her. That garb, yes, it's her, Kian. That's naked kid. Uh, the self same confectioner of whom I just spoke. We must have her at once. Oh no! Come on, let's go. Let's go because that's what I do. I help people. Right, I've just spoken to piano. Right, where is uh, the naked? She is on for deed. Come on, naked. Wake up. Uh, Will should be alright now. Oh, uh, no? Yeah. Will should be alright now. In any event, I'll leave her to your capable hands. Okay, thank you. Um, right, okay. Off you trot. Come on, wake up your potato. Ugh. That's what I thought as well. Oh, naked! You come back to us. Thank the gods. P uh, piano, is that you? Why, I'm back in Costa del Packet. You are indeed. 
Whatever happened to you out there? Were you swept away in the storm? Tossed from your boat by some eldritch horror from the depths of the sea? I fear my memory is still hazy. As I remember, we sailed to the northern seas where, after braving the elements and some vicious fiends set on making a meal of me, I succeeded in procuring the most pristine ice I'd ever laid eyes on. Or even upon. Ugh. Ugh. Oh. We began the journey back, and just as we were approaching Costa del Paque, it's no use. The only thing I can remember is our vessel capsizing and my body being flung from the deck along with my hard-won supply of ice. Smiley face. But at least I made it back in one piece and I have you and your friend here to thank for that piano. Me. My dearest friends, you two survived the shipwreck. Why I couldn't be with, uh, couldn't be happier. Lyho, these creatures are your friends, aren't they lovely? We met on one of the isles up north. I shared some of my treats with them, and the next thing I knew, they were following me everywhere. They're gentle and strong, and the most perfect companions, really. Well, that's what happens when you build animals. They come after you. All right, that's enough of the touching reunion. My precious ice is scattered all over the place. Go and round it up and bring it back here. On the double now. Brar. Mummy and baby bear. Well, would you look at that? They're quite clever, aren't they? Uh huh. They also understand what you're saying. Oh, lucky days. The seals are intact and the ice inside undamaged and unmelted. That means only one problem. Uh, one potential rub remains. What will you say? It couldn't be a rub? What's a rub? I don't know what a rub is. What's a rub? Yes, as a matter of fact, the ice you see is everything I hoped it would be, which is why it is rather what? It, which is why it was rather uh, rather to my whatever that is when I later discovered that a dreadful fiend slumbered in, the la in a rather large chunk of ice that I loaded onto the vessel. Oh, right. Oh, okay. So you dug up fossilised ice and we got a big bomb. Yes, it's all coming back to me now. It's a song. As we near Costadel's packet, with the uh, uh, blarmy winds drafted in, I heard a dreadful rumbling coming across from the cargo hold. I rushed down to investigate only to see the fearsome creature. It appeared rather perturbed by the heat. And, oh, I told you. I get tired and I start reading. Uh, and it suddenly began to swell larger and larger until It would appear my own carelessness was the cause of the unfortunate incident. Fortunately, my fairy companions and I survived the shipwreck. As for my stock of the purest ice, and yet I fear that the fiend will be back in search of the, I oh, of the icy home, so I unceremoniously stole it from him. 
Uh, whatever I might do. Hmm. Let me think. Have no fear, my dear Nikid. Uh, in affairs uh, over the years, my friends and I have fought off more bomba bombards than you can shake a stick at. Why, bombard buster. Uh, why, uh, why, bombard buster. Could be my middle name. Okay. Now, let's go apprise a uh, hemorrhoid uh, of the situation. Surely he'll have an idea as how to how we can deal with the menace and kick the festivities off the bank. Yes, we should not do it. Bye! Oh no, teddy bears! Oh, we be fine. Bye! Right, okay. Uh, rescue naked from peril. Right, okay. Come on! Kian, I was wondering when I might hear back from you and Piano. And I see our star confectioner has joined you as well. Pray tell, how did you fare? Oh dear, so while the ice has been safely procured, a blustery bombard of behemoth-like proportions has been pro procured alongside it. No doubt that has something to do with the panic screams I've heard coming from the beach. No, Poop Einstein. But not to worry, after all, what's a moon moon fire fair if not a season for blasting ill tempered hot headed balloons out of the air? And I know just the person to assist us in that effort. Just a moment now. Say no more, Master Hemorrhoid. I stand ever the ready, my friends. That makes no sense. Who, who goes there? I have no idea. <sighs> Surely you have heard tales of uh, Tracy. Brave leader of the bombard, bomba, bombardiers, and bane of bomba, bomb, <laughs> bomb, bombards, the realm over. Or perhaps you haven't. No, I haven't. But no matter. Pray rest assured, and uh, that I and my companions will see safely return to to be the beaches. Oh, good grief! Uh, Bargu, uh, Bargu too has come to save the day and he has bought his fun little toys, trinkets, trifles, toys. Oh yes, Bargo has bought his toys that go boom. And I'm Ruffle Tire, 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 whatever. I may still be. <laughs> new <laughs> to this adventure in business but I promise you that whatever I lack in experience I make up for in pork. Pork? Spirit and uh, determination? This whole mess was all my fault and I still uh, and still so many of you have come to my aid. How can I ever repay you? Nonsense, my dear. The ice you bought was at our behest, and all we have given, uh, uh, blah, 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 and all and all will be forgiven when you fashion us the most delightful frosty dessert. Master Greg has uh, ever laid eyes on. Besides, besides the exploits of Bombard Buster's adventures are sure to bring even more good publicity to the guild. That settles it then. Let's get out there and show the oversized ball of ice that the Isles of the Endless Summer is no place for his ilk. Oh yes, let's go kick his ass. Oop, go away, shoot. Moths. Yuck. Right, let's go kick his 
some Bootay! Right! We need to go. Where did we see the bombard thing? So we end. Hopefully, yeah, there's some people there. said it ends a five minutes respawn. Oh, not sure when it is going to be up. Bunny girls, look. That's three bunny girls. They look like Charlie's Angels. <laughs> oh, yeah. I have no idea who they are, but there you go. Ah, it's a dragoon. I have no idea what that one is. That's a monkey. Motorcycle like wings. At least then it would look like it should be flying. That's I think Titan. No, it's a frip. Oh there it is, there it is, there it is, there it is, there it is. Yeah. 
probably don't know what I'm doing. But I'm fine. I'm just pushing buttons. <laughs> okay, let's have a look. What have we got to say for ourselves? That look of relief and supreme satisfaction on your faces. Am I to surmise that you've succeeded in driving off the most baleful bombard? Indeed, and we scarcely even broke a sweat in their doing. Isn't that right, piano? Quite so, my friend. Though I dare say it would have been wouldn't have been nearly as so easy without Kiana outside. I can't think of I can't thank you enough, my friend. I don't do anything. <laughs> oh, oh dear. And yet we must remain ever vigilant for there is no telling when the dread creature's friends uh, may return to seek their revenge. In any event, the Isle of Endless Summer is safe for now and that is what matters the most. You truly are heroes, all of you. Well, all's well that ends well, I say, and with that, I say it's time we retreat our supplies from the beach. Okay. Crack on. Splendid. Uh, just you wait, my friends. Uh, Naked is gonna be is going to prepare the most marvellous dessert this realm has ever seen. has a mind to whip up a finest frozen dessert you've ever laid eyes on. Oh Kian, I can't thank you enough. Were it not for you, I have been too busy running for my life to even think of making Master Greg's dessert. But all's well that ends well, and finally I can get down to what I was brought here to do. I promise you I've done I, pro I promise you, I'll be done before you know it. So why don't you and Piano entertain yourselves for the time being? Uh, and while you're at it, perhaps you could call Master Greg as well. Uh, I'm sure he'll he's more e eager than any to see my masterpiece take form. Okay. Ah, uh, Kian, truly impressive the way you chased off the bombard. Why, one would never imagine that this was your first time taking part in the festivities. Well, it is, actually. Thanks to you, I think we, are, we can safely say the Guild part, uh, put on another impressive show this year. It's only a matter of time before our halls are overflowing with aspiring adventures. Adventurers, even. Talk about making the best of a bad situation. Speaking of which, I heard Naked's Nye done with her delightful creation. I don't know about you, but I'm most eager to taste it myself. Believe it or not, I have something uh, of a sweet tooth. Okay. Yeah, I can guess that now. Right. <coughs> right, uh, let's go and talk to these people. Piano, Arkian again, I thank you for your efforts in helping us dispatch the bombards. To think that such a calamity would befall us on the eve of the festivities, but pray don't be too hard on Naked, she meant only to please, as she always has. Oh, in, in all the confusion I forgot to mention it, but she actually she's actually a childhood friend of mine. 
we used to play together by the shore and one day we were set upon by a vicious monster. We thought we were done for but we were saved in the neck of time by a kindly adventurer who swiftly dispatched the beast and whisked us away to safety. That's when I vowed that one day I would serve the guild and repay my debt to the brave soul who rescued me. Meanwhile, Nekid was a genius in the kitchen since she was a girl. She chose the park of culinary, uh, culinarian as a cook or a chef, whatever, in hopes of uh, finally, uh, filling the bellies of adventurers all over with nourishing uh, and toothsome snacks. In the end, she found her calling making sweets, as, uh, as opposed to the sort of hearty meals that you and I might favour. But that's rather fitting for her, she's always had an independent streak after all. In any event, she's positively overjoyed that her latest creation will be presented front and centre at the fair for adventurers all over to enjoy. More than anything, I'm glad she's back with a safe and sound. Okay, that was a lot of peels. Right, over here for a swim. Let's go for a swim. Do I need to go for a swim? Yeah, we'll go for a swim. Wow. Well, swim. Just keep swimming. Just keep swimming. I should have actually gone on a mount. <laughs> oh well, oh, I'll go for a swim in a nice beautiful Caribbean water in Costel Packet. Okay, now I'm just gonna... Okay, Master Greg. Oh, if it isn't the ever resourceful and oh so forgiving adventurer who we so in... Nominiously asked, uh, tasked with gathering ingredients for our banquet. Okay, what's this you say? The f uh, fiends have been dispatched, and my prize desert is ready for tasting. Why didn't you tell me sooner? Oh well, because I didn't actually know. Right, okay, so now we're gonna run. Bye, bye, my pretty. Beautiful, look at that. <gasps> yeah, we get to swim underwater. Uh, not here though. Okay, let's go back to uh, Naked. Oh, it's you. You couldn't have come at a better time. I was just put, uh, putting the finishing touches on my masterpiece. So wait for a moment, won't you? Yep, I will. Adventurers, it's all Eorzeans, fairgoers, friends, Eorzeans, fairgoers, friends, I am most proud to present my latest creation. I call it Costa del Helio. Whatever. And I promise you that it will please your tongue even more than it does your eyes. It's ice with some fruit. Okay. And to make sure that it doesn't melt, as well as uh, to help all of you stay cool amidst the scorching heat, I leave you with my present from my furry friends. Uh, I don't know what that means. Snowing! Dun dun dun! In, in Costa del Paque, it's snowing. Cool. I'm a bit sort of like silly, really. But there you go. Snow. Right, what was I saying? Ah, Kian, well, 
Did my dessert agree with you? Uh, not really, I don't like cold things. After all the trouble I put you through, one can only hope so. Uh, it was more than worth the trouble. Your friends put on quite the show. It was simply sublime. I'm going to go with your friends put on quite the show. Now that's a relief to hear. If it provided you with true refreshment after all your travails, why, as a confectioner and a, cur a cook, nothing could make me happier? Uh, I don't like slush puppies, not really. But there you go. Speaking of which, I had meant to tell you, ever since you chased off those bombards, my little friend here has been able to t hasn't been able to take her eyes off of you. Just look at her face, as it's. If she's trying, if she's saying, "Oh, Miss Adventurer, what I wouldn't give to join you on your travels." That's a nice picture. Okay, take a picture. Oh, truly, how kind you are. She's most. Uh, she'll be most wonderful companion on the road. I promise you that. And with that, I. I'd best get back to the kitchen. After all, adventurers from all the corners of the realms have come to taste my latest, greatest creation. Until we meet again, a happy moon fire occurred to you. Okay. Bye! <laughs> okay. Wow. Message from the dark side, there is. This is just stunning. I love this place. Okay. Yay! Here we go. We've got a new, a new mount. Polar bear mount. That's, uh, thanks to your efforts, peace has returned to the beaches of Costal Packet and the festivities can commence in earnest. That is, until the bombard menace rears its ugly head. Ew. You may now purchase wares from the Moonfire Fair vendor, participate in the fates appearing in the southern regions of the fairgrounds to earn vouchers that can be exchanged for goods. Oh, that's alright then. But, saying that though, uh, I don't think there's nothing worth it, to be honest with you. I don't have anything um, really anything worth it was the uh, mount. You've got a Moonfire Mast stall, which I can't uh, put in a what do I call it? I can't, that's all I can see to it. The problem is it's out of furnishing and you need a house to put it in and I don't have a house. Uh, you've got grilled corn, which is a tabletop item, which you put on the table which I don't got a table. I've got a room in my guild hall, in the guild hall, but that's five tokens, I've got ten tokens. I might as well just get one. Okay, uh, show you five tokens for that. Oh, well, fifteen tokens. And across the Dow Paleo, I might as well buy one, but not that one here, but I'll take it to my, my room before I log out. And uh, I'll show you what I've actually got so far. The rest of these, I'm not entirely sure what they are. Oh, they're just like bangers and sparklers and what I've used and pinwheels. Uh, I don't do that. And that's that for this one. There's absolutely nothing else at all. Did I just hear a sheep? She's got absolutely nothing for us. So, right, okay. Let's have a butcher's at me new mount. Right, let's have a look. I haven't looked at my mount yet. Uh, mount guide. These are all the mounts I've got. Uh, 
Oh, this is silly. Oh my goodness. That's a special maneuver. Movement thing. Snowing. Well, at Christmas time in Coerthis, that would look alright, not out of place. <laughs> oh my goodness. That doesn't. 